Hello, my beautiful collective, and welcome back to my channel, Luma Moon Tarot. So, everybody, I am here um, just checking into the energy, right? Seeing what's going on around you in love. Whatever spirit wants to come out, right, is coming out. Anyway, just take what resonates, leave the rest behind, and thank you so much, everyone, for all of your support. For real, the likes, subscribes, everybody who's joined the Soul Tribe, thank you so much. And I, I do want to say, you guys, thank you for the comments. You know why? Because um, it makes me feel closer to you. And when I feel closer to you guys, I'm, I'm, I'm connecting more with your energy. Okay, let's just say it like that. I can connect more with your energy. So thank you for the comments and the likes. Um, just thank you. You know, you guys are wonderful out here. All right. So spirit, what do you have for my beautiful collective messages for the collective, please? What is going on? I feel like someone is realizing here, um, let me just get some more cards out. Somebody is realizing that they've been a puppet that they've been duped um, by some devil energy, okay? Uh, yeah. I feel like, you know what? I feel like this is your energy. You were hung out to dry, man. You were made a sacrifice. Um, you know, it just feels to me like you were blamed for everything, put on display. Everybody was laughing at you. Everybody got their licks in, okay? And you just, all you had to do was take it. Like, you didn't, you didn't fight. You didn't retaliate. You didn't really say anything at all, I feel. I mean, look at you. Just look at the picture, you know? Thrown to the wolves. And I feel like this, there's a masculine, or it could be a feminine energy that's doing a lot of crying. Um, take it how it resonates with you, masculine or feminine. It doesn't really matter. It's never gender specific in tarot. We just pick up on the energy. I'm getting the sense it was a masculine energy who um, really feels like they listened to the wrong people. Okay, They allowed other people to guide them. And those people were just devilish toxic karmic energies um i'm feeling like it was a whole group of people okay and they just wouldn't stop like torturing you okay they they were relentless and it was one right after another And I feel like all you've done is work on yourself, okay? You've been left alone. It, it almost feels like these are people that you gave a lot of love to in the past. I'm seeing all of these pentacles as like skulls. I don't know why I'm seeing them that way. I, I, I'm going to be honest with you, but I'm seeing them as like skulls. These were people that you once were very caring for. Um, to very nurturing okay you were always there for these people and they all betrayed you like these were people that you knew could be a family group it could be close friends they all turned on you and they left you by yourself I feel okay you were alone I feel like whoever is whoever's done this to you and who's, who's put you in this, it feels like public humiliation, like people just kind of ripped you apart. Um, you lost a lot of close relationships from whatever happened to you, um, but it wasn't anything that you did. You know, you'd, I don't see that you did anything wrong to these people. I feel like you were turned into a sacrifice. Um, Yeah, and I feel like it was, you know, people like bullied you. You could have been very bullied by people in the community, in a group. Um, it was heartbreaking, but I, I'm feeling like you're in the star energy, though. You've got this star here, so people are starting to see, you know, um, what they've done. Yeah, you could have been dealing with a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. I feel like they're looking back now at the one that they've 
done this to i'm also feeling like you could you could be a cancer pisces scorpio taurus virgo capricorn maybe um a libra gemini aquarius heavy on cancer though let's see i'm seeing all this water you're very intuitive and now people are starting to see it i'm seeing water but you're actually hmm, it's almost as if Somebody here could be drowning in their emotions, too, because there's a whole lot of crying going on, and someone's having this new beginning, or they want a new beginning. Clarify this person. I feel like it's not your energy collective. I feel like it's somebody who wants to come towards you now and make this right, but there's just been too much done to you, okay? There's too great of a distance, not just a physical distance, you know, but also um energetically there's been too much time maybe between you okay but they want to come back in now they want a second chance yeah the king of pentacles i'm seeing two of cups here uh, you know honestly you had to turn your back on this person i don't think they gave you any choice This King of Pentacles knows they're going to have to leave some people behind to come and get back together with you. I'm seeing two cups here in a King of Pentacles card. Okay, they could be in another commitment somewhere else as well. But I feel like they want to leave some people behind. Yeah, they're feeling like a complete and utter fool. This person believed other people over you. And they I literally threw you to the wolves, okay? And you know, you had a sword here. Um, you could have spoken your truth. You could have said something, but you chose not to. You chose people to make their own decisions. And you allowed the divine to um, deliver karma when it was divine timing, right? I mean, I feel like you, you just, um, you took your licks by each and every one of these people. And now there's a people or there's a person who feels like they were a puppet. They they believed everyone else or they went along with the attacks. Okay, there could have been spiritual attacks done on you. There could have been spell work done on you. You I mean, you were brutalized, I feel. Okay? At, at least energetically. And they know they listened to the wrong people in doing this. King of Wands energy, this person, whoever this is, they're feeling pretty upset about this. Um, and they're seeing also a flame that's burning out. Like you may not feel about them the same way. I'm seeing this as a candle that's burning out. Okay. And I'm seeing them crying over this as well. Very emotional. Nine of Swords energy. They can't stop thinking about you. Yeah, now this person, look at Look at how roles have been reversed. Do you see this? Now they're getting kind of tied up, caught up, but they're seeing things from a whole new perspective. This is somebody waking up, okay? They may be facing some ridicule as well from, um, you know, if, if people were that feeble in who they believed in, right? Enough to turn their back on you after you were very loving and caring. These same people are turning their back on this person as well. And they're realizing it's, it's waking them up. It's showing them who's real and who isn't. You know, who deserves to be treated right and, um, and who doesn't? Who's in their life, really? I mean, um... I think both of you were dealing with like a karmic group of people. Your person listened to them and they allowed you to be ripped apart. Okay. I feel like you've been in isolation here. Yeah, see, and there's people that were just lingering, waiting to attack you here. I'm just looking at the picture, but look at you. Um, I feel like you're holding a cup of spirituality in your hand, so you're listening to the messages from the divine. You had to spend time in isolation because you didn't know who to trust, who, 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 you, who you could trust, who you couldn't. 
you know, you didn't know who you could give your love and caring to because those people betrayed you and turned on you here. So you know what? I feel like you ignored them all. You still haven't spoken your truth. Um, you haven't retaliated. Nothing. You didn't seek any kind of revenge. You've done nothing to these people. I feel like all you want now is just to be um, to be at peace. You you want some peace of mind. You you don't want to get involved in any karmic situations or fighting or um, yeah. You had to stay away from people in your community, friends, family. Knight of Wands, you were played. You were played, and I feel like you're the one who took the blame. And everybody, I feel like they all turned away from you. These are the friends, the family. You know what? Now these people, though, they're on their knees. Each and every one of them are on their knees, um, suffering a lot of burdens for how they treated you. Listen to me, collective. If you don't think these people have gotten their karma, I am telling you, um, they're getting it bad. They're feeling bad now, maybe, for turning their back on you. And how they treated you. And I feel like after everything that you've been through, Collective, look at how tired and drained you look. But you're the last one standing. I'm telling you, everybody else is on their knees. This whole community who went up against you, turned on you, tortured you, they're now on their knees, stuck on a ledge. Okay? And you're the last one standing. You may be tired, you may be drained, you may, be, you may have had to fight your way through this because this is a warrior queen. This is the queen of wands. You could be a Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. And you're, you're looking like, why did these people do this to me? But still, you're the last one standing. I kid you not. And all of these people, now they're going to be getting their karma. Ten of Pentacles, you're going to be getting your wish fulfillment. And they have to watch. They have to watch in amazement that they won the one that uh, that they bullied, brutalized, and and put through hell is now getting ultimate wish fulfillment. Yeah, I feel like you're about to be blessed with um, a lot of abundance here, money, um, stability. You're gonna you're transforming your life. You're the true treasure here. This is your, and I feel like um, you've made a commitment to yourself. You're no longer giving to other people. You're just working on you. And that's the kind of look that you have here. Like, I'm tired. I'm drained. I'm busy. Why do you people keep attacking me? You can sense when a karmic storm is coming in. Okay, you can feel it. And you're just working on yourself here in this picture. Okay. These people would not leave you alone. I don't know who these people are to you. You're going to have to take what, how it resonates with you, okay? It could be a family group, a friend group. I feel like it's kind of a, a mixture of everybody. Everyone you had in your life. You know, they led this person astray. I feel like they all enjoyed whooping on you, okay? Behind the scenes, they were, they were dragging your reputation through the mud, saying whatever they wanted to say, making you feel humiliated in public. You probably felt like you couldn't go anywhere, you know, without, like, bumping into somebody that you didn't want to see who's misjudging you and blaming you for something you didn't cause. It's, it's ridiculous what was done to you, Collective. It's really triggering me. Like, I'm getting angry about this because I can see what's been done to you, okay? And this is my collective out here. You guys are my friends and family and my, my soul family, so I'm sorry. I'm getting triggered. I'm getting, these people are making me angry. But just know this, man, you tolerated their crap for so long. And I'm telling you, 
they're going to get every bit of it back. This is a whole lot of burdens here on these people, and it is a whole entire group of people. All right? Now, one of these people stood up for you. I get so angry, but you know what? I'm really getting triggered in this reading. You're getting, uh, the wheel of fortune is turning in your favor. I feel like spirit is saying, just make a wish, right? Make a wish, spin the wheel, <laughs> right? I feel like you're going to be blessed here a lot. You've got the 10 of pentacles. That's the most pentacles you can have in the deck there. That's, that's a lot of wealth and stability, okay? And that's generational wealth. So whatever, what, and this is a fortune, you know? I feel like you're still doing some healing here because you're, uh, you're kind of standing in this emotion. But you've got it under control. Like, you've got this collective. And you know you're holding the world in the palm of your hands here. You know, Empress Energy attracting new things to you. All of these new fi these fish down here, these are new love options. I feel like you've got love all around you. You may not realize it, but you do. I feel like, too, wherever you go, people are now, like, staring at you, interested in what you're doing, where you're going next. Um, maybe even coming up and asking weird questions. Uh, yeah, people, you walk into a room and people are staring and they stop and they look and they just have to be around you. So you're in that kind of energy now of receiving, okay? Um, receiving attention, love, respect. Because these, these people over here that did all of this to you, they're being taught some respect for you right now. Uh, it's, uh, it's ridiculous what was done to you. I am, I'm really mad, you guys, over this. I'm sorry. But like I said, you're my peeps, and I don't like to see this happening to somebody. Yeah, they're getting skewered. Um, you know, I had this card earlier come out in a cancer video, so you could have some cancer in your chart. You're, you've got, uh, you could be any sign out here with the Empress. You've, you've acquired every queen in the deck. Okay. Um, yeah. These people are facing a karmic storm. They're losing everything. Everything in their life is getting tossed about, you know, turned upside down. Um, this is someone who's getting a lot of karma. And I feel like they can't, they can't make a move towards you or... Um, I'm getting the sense, too, that you're protecting yourself here. And spirit is now you're separated. There's some kind of um, separation between you and these people, probably because of years of, being, of you spending your, all your time in isolation away from them. Um, yeah, now you're out of that energy, and these people can get their karma, um, and it won't touch you, okay? And that's what's happening. Honestly, Four of Swords, I feel like you're just resting easy. Like you don't have any problem sleeping at night. But these people over here, they can't rest. We were in the Eight and Nine of Swords energy I saw in the deck. So um, they're getting no rest. You could be sleeping like a baby. You may end up having some pretty intense dreams, too, about these, the, um, these people who have betrayed you just falling one right after another. Boom, boom, boom. Or as a whole entire group. They're scared, too. Some of them are scared. Someone here could be um, having some kind of trouble with their I want to say it's like some kind of blood infection or something. I don't know why I'm picking up on that. They're they're in really they could be um getting some really bad health issues. Oh. Yeah, well, the way they treated you, they deserve some bad karma. They've accrued bad karma for this. And you're getting your justice. I'm telling you, karma and justice for you. 
you're able to sleep. You don't have a lot of regrets of how you handled yourself and the situation because you didn't do anything to retaliate. You didn't do anything wrong to these people. And they all turned against you. Yeah, and there's going to be somebody new, I feel, who, um, you know, who comes into the picture to protect you and watch over you, okay? You have totally been in isolation. Yeah, and then we have the Ace of Cups. So, and look at the tears that you're wiping from your face. It's so sad what's been done to you, Collective. I am so sorry. None of, the, none of these people have even bothered to come and apologize to you either. I'll say it. I am so sorry that this happened to you. It makes me so mad, you guys. It really does. But you are getting your justice, and they are receiving their karma. The scales are being balanced for every bit of wrongdoing that they've done. Um, they're getting karma for that. For every bit of torture you had to go through because of these people and the love you put out there, you're getting your dharma. You're getting blessed. You're sleeping at night. You got no regrets of how you handled yourself, others, and the situation. Man, I'm telling you. Spirit is going to be taking care of you, okay? They're sending you... Um, wealth, possibly a fortune, uh, financial stability, probably for the rest of your life. And they're sending you new love in here as well with the Ace of Cups. Someone who's going to protect you. No one's, getting, no one's getting to you through this big bear, okay? Um, this new person, may, there may be like a a size difference to each of you, right? You could be a, a lot smaller than this new person. I feel like they're going to be one big, tough cookie, okay? <laughs> um, yeah, and they're going to protect you. Oh, collective, I'm sorry. I get so angry in some of these readings, okay? And this is, this is one of them. Um, let's see what your oracles say. All right, what messages do you have for my beautiful collective? You could be a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. You could be any sign in the deck, really. I've got um, uh, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, maybe Libra, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. And there is a masculine who's sorry, but I feel like they all must suffer their karma. Okay, they all want, they all need to suffer their karma. Yeah, see, right now you're letting things end. Um, you want to be happy. You want your ten of cups. Uh, some of you could even possibly be making a, a location change somewhere else because honestly, all of these people, wherever you've been, ev pretty much everyone you've cared about has turned on you. And the divine doesn't want you in isolation anymore. I feel like they, the spirit wants you to come out of isolation and start living your life. Um, they want you to be happy. The universe wants you to be happy. So I feel like here you're, you're being led to focus on new things. Okay. You could even be getting a lot of downloaded messages right now. Spirit kind of answering the questions you may have. All right. Um, because I feel like you, you, you didn't, you still don't feel like you got your justice out of this. I mean, what these people did to you was horrible. Yeah, you really, all you wanted was the truth. You just wanted somebody to be honest with you. Maybe give you con some consideration. You know, consider your feelings at all. But um, you never got that. So I feel like spirit is showing you what you didn't know before. Um, maybe in a dream, you know, those vivid dreams I was talking about, right? You're going to be getting the answers that will put all the pieces together um, so that you can move forward and truly be happy. Because you've got, you also have new 
Um, I feel like it's this could be anything. It could be an opportunity. This is new energy, right? But I feel this is masculine energy, so I feel like somebody's coming in. Look, I'm telling you, I feel like someone is coming in that's going to guard over you, protect you, be there for you. And you know this. There's, there's, um, you trust your intuition. But I feel like you've been, it, yep, it's time to come out of isolation. What did I just say? It's time to come out of isolation now. So you can find this new love, this new person. Sorry, collective, my battery died. Um, or so that this new person can find you, okay? Um, see, when, when spirit wants something from, for you, when they want something for you, they have to line everything up just so, so you bump right into it, okay? And that's what they're doing. If you spend all of your time isolated at home, that's what you're used to now because of the environment you were in before. If you keep staying at home all the time and no one ever sees you and you don't get out there, number one, it's not healthy for you to do that. Number two, the divine wants you to live your life, not just merely survive it. Okay, and number three, they want to get you somewhere where you're going to bump into this new love. Feel like this is someone new. And the divine is trying to maybe either get you to make a location change or just get you out of the house. Um, start living your life again, collective, you know. And just know that these, these haters in the background, their uh, the spirit is whooping them okay for what they've done to you yeah look spirits trying to lead you you know and i feel like you're gonna get the answers that you need what did i say you're probably there's still some pieces that are missing like you don't understand like why did this have to happen to me why did everybody turn against me you know i didn't do anything to anybody spirit's gonna spirit is going to show you everything you need to know so that you can move forward okay so pay close attention to your dreams um watch for all of the signs you know not, remember nothing is trivial either you know, sometimes i'll tell you what helps with me i'll go for a nice long country drive okay yeah, and the fall time right now autumn it's beautiful you guys maybe maybe just Go out driving or go for a walk, you know. Um, but uh, I listen to the radio in the car and I'll ask spirit questions. And in the next song, they will give me an answer. I'm telling you, I have full on conversations with them in my car, you guys, because I listen to that music and in the lyrics, they will actually give me the answer. Try it. Try it. I do it all the time, and um, it just puts my mind at ease, and I feel like maybe that's what you, you know, you're looking for answers about something, like why did all of these people not believe and trust in me, right? Spirit will show you, but just know that they're trying to get you out and about. It's time for you to live your life again. It's time for you to show the world you know that beautiful smile you know what i mean um and i feel like they're going to lead you right to the right person for you who's going to love you the right way anyway collective listen that's what i've got for this message um i hope it helps i hope it resonates don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel right um join this awesome soul tribe and until next time everyone take care of you and peace out